Okay, so you guys are definitely not gonna believe this. <sighs> I'm about to change my oil right now, and I gotta tell you guys what happened. You probably already read the uh, the title or whatever, but this is wild. You're not gonna believe it. Here we go. Hmm. I never did get around to organizing these wrenches. Gotta work on that eventually. Also, can't ever remember what size it is for the oil drain plug, but I'll just take all of them. For this video, Chandler, when you watch it back, next time you go to Harbor Freight, buy more lighting. What the heck? Every time I use my bat use my battery to jump somebody off, I always forget to put this back. I'm like genuinely surprised that it's still even in the engine bay. When was the last time I, got? I think the, when I went to the Mon's house, I think I may have jumped off his WRX or something. I don't know. But I always forget to put that back on there. I can't believe it's still there. It never fails that every time I change oil, I get it. I don't know if you can see that, but I get it all over the place all over my arm, my shirt, all on the floor. Never fails, whatever. While I let that oil drain out, I'm gonna show you the kind of oil I'm putting in, in case any of you care. This is Valvoline Full Synthetic 10W0W20 and a Pure Oilator. Pretty, pretty expensive, but you know, Nothing's too good for my girl. That girl, anyway. Sorry, Kayla. Also, I'm pretty sure most of you don't ever think about this, but it is extremely hard to film and like work on a car at the same time, especially when you have like greasy hands and you don't want to touch the camera. It is such a huge pain in the butt. There, there's like oil right now on like my expensive camera. It sucks. Also, Valvoline, since you're not watching this, I'm just gonna say, you know, give an obligatory sponsor me message anyway, even though you're not watching this, cause you know, that's just what us YouTubers do. Mostly, us small YouTubers. I'm not even a YouTuber. I just make YouTube videos, but oh crap. But sponsor me anyway, Valvoline, cause you're not watching this, but I'm gonna say it anyway and not get sponsored. Your oil is great. You know, I just spilled it all over my engine bay like an idiot. Oops. Yeah, I gotta wipe up all that oil I just spilled. All right, come here, you. Woo, still hot. There it goes. Woo! Yeah, that thing is warm. I ain't even driven the car in a few hours. All right, and I'm just gonna throw on this Pure Later Boss, it says. Expensive filter. 
throw a little oil in there. On the threads. There's a lot of dirt down in here. I'll wipe that out. That's like one of the biggest things I love about the new Subaru FA20 engine. The oil filter is literally right there on top. Best thing, best thing ever. Still gotta get under the car to do the oil drain plug, but having the uh, filter right up here at the top where you, you don't have to get under the car and try to finagle it out in a tight space, best feeling ever. Oh, man. All right, it's humid out here, but yeah, I'm, I'm sure you're wondering what the, just, never mind. Just let, I'm just gonna show you. Just let me show you. So most of you are aware that I recently came up on a Pandem V3 kit for this car. I have a Pandem V3 kit, right? Right. All right, cool. Not gonna cut it. Not gonna edit it, just one. One long clip. Get that lined up. All right, yeah, that's good enough. Yeah, there's that one, and there's also this one. <sighs> Somebody tell me what's going on, because I didn't pay for this. Yeah, um, if somebody could tell me what the deal is with that, uh, comment below, because I, I don't, I don't know, I don't know, this is, uh, beyond my comprehension. So, st story was, um, took me like five, five-ish months to get my original Pandem kit. Uh, I forgot to, I actually left out a clip explaining that whole story in the pandem vid video when i um received it from the shipping company <sighs> out of breath it's hot um but yeah story was i bought it in like january um it got here in a couple months the they sent it to me the shipping company lo lost it uh they get they ordered a new one the when it came in, the bumper was damaged, so I didn't want that one either. So I'll just keep waiting until I get one that's not damaged. Finally get my kit five months later. Um, Yeah, yeah, I just get my kit five months later. About a month later, a month-ish later, I get an email saying I have another package coming. I don't know what the heck is going on. I thought I got my package already. I didn't order it. Um, And then, just a couple weeks ago that shows up so i don't i don't <laughs> if you if you thought you were going to get an answer as to why i have two pandem kits from the title of this video i know just as much as you do i have no idea i don't even know why i'm making this video but um yeah i have i have two of them they sent me an extra bumper so the one that's in the wrapper right now still that's for sale. If anybody wants that, hit me up and you can get it. If you're doing a pandem build or you just need an extra bumper or you're just a baller, like I'm not, you can hit me up and you can get that. I'll send it to you for, I don't know, just hit me up on Instagram. Link's in the description. I'll just put it up on the screen. Yeah, hit me up for that. Yeah, uh, don't forget, Tuner Evo is this Saturday. I believe this video is going up on Friday. If not, 
then rip me or edit this out. But the video is going up Friday, which is today for you if you're watching it when it comes out. But um, it's Tuner Evo Saturday, excuse me, the 16th. If you see me there, come say what's up. Um, I doubt any of you watching this will be there, but if you're there, come say what's up. Tuner Evo in Atlanta. So yeah, uh, the moral of this story is there isn't one. It's the most random video I'll probably ever make, I would assume. But yeah, I have a Pandem V3 front bumper for sale if any of you want it. Sorry for the sweat, it's hot out here, but um, I guess I'm gonna end this video right here. Uh, comment below what you think happened. Uh, I'm so, I'm so, bye, I'm so lost.